Okay, hang on, dangle. Let's Side talk balance. about falling first, okay? We're going from strata back, mm -hmm. so she knows this guy. Man, Sammy, your legs are freaking strong. Have we done that before? This yes, we have. Okay. I need to bring that short down. Okay, let's talk about a fall, okay? Mm -hmm. My strong side, I believe, is this side, right? Yeah, that sounds right. We're a little deeper, please. Uh -huh. okay. uh, Falling-wise, if I'm going over here, and then I'm trying to grab over, my, <laughs> weight, my weight's going to tumble towards my head at all times. Because that's where all your body weight's going to... You start pulling, that's why you want to move really slow. I moved fast and purpose there. Move really slow. You could fall this way. And because you're bound, you're holding onto your own limbs, your landing gear, way dangerous, right? So your base is going to, um, first and foremost, she's aware that you could fall this way. Um, so the whole point about this class today is the theme of midlining, right? She's gotta keep this foot in, right? But how do you protect yourself from falling there? The moment you feel like you're being dropped, you can feel that in your body. She'll also verbally say down, you unbind your hand, you place your hands on the mat as quick as you can. Okay. Otherwise, your head's hitting the ground first. Okay? Yeah. So it's really, really key um, to know that more than likely you'll fall towards where you're going towards. Okay? So, um, so watch, watch what, um, let's get clear about what point B is, right? What angle dangle looks like. Nice. Toes and beautiful. I'm reaching over with my feet through there. Okay. Uh, so you go from supporting me with two legs to supporting me along that flank right there. Much strength. And then transition that leg back. Mm -hmm. in. And the more that you notice that first time you did it when that second leg came up, that's when all the weight yes. went over? you have to really open out. So don't lose track of what the other leg is doing. Okay. Yeah. So this leg, I'm really engaging it and putting it, the more open I am, the easier it is for her to balance me. I'm bringing this leg down. I'm grabbing super tight onto now, that were ankle. You trying to, were you say where you were driving more in, like were you trying to be open into a split or were you more focused on getting the leg down to the ground? It feels pretty Does that equal. make sense? Because I'm... Like, am I straining to be this way, or am I straining to be like in a pancake? Oh, uh, open, not okay, pancake. This way. Okay. Yeah. Because the more you can stack okay. your shoulders, <laughs> the more the weight will be evenly distributed on the top of my foot. Okay. So if you try and start pancake at all, the weight's going to be uh, harder to balance. And okay. naturally, when you when she takes this foot off of your hip your body's gonna turn a little. Mm -hmm. It wants to fall this way. It wants to kind of turn this way, I believe. And yeah, you'll feel me. Yeah. She, you'll really. feel Sammy go like this. Curl your toes to keep you nice and flat this way. Okay. So you'll feel that pressure there. As soon as it's too much, you can say down. Yeah. And she'll support your shoulder.